Andy, obviously much better result today. Much better result, but much better performance as well. It wasn't just the, the result that pleased me. Obviously, you want to win every game you go into, but I was much more pleased with the performance, especially after the first 20 minutes. I thought Brecon came out really strongly, like we knew we would. You know, I've watched their, their games against St Johnston and Morton, and I knew they would be they would come out the traps, you know, flying and going after them because that's what they do. That's the way um, I just got them set up to, to do. And, and I thought they were good for the first 20, 25 minutes. Once we dealt with that a bit better and started passing the ball more, I thought we looked a much better threat. And um, you know, I thought second half we really came into our own and, and started to dominate the ball better, create more chances and, and it's it's really good to, to get to get the win as you say, get the three points. Yeah, helped by the early impact uh, uh, Luke Rankin again just being sharp in the box. Hundred percent that's what he that's what he brings. You know, he brings that sharpness and that enthusiasm. It's a great it's a good ball by, by Cal Waters put into in, in the space and that Luke makes the he makes it a ball by by going and, and chasing it down and, and nicking it past the goalkeeper and it's it's a penalty that's really well dispatched by by Scott Taggart again so that that did settle us down I thought um, but even then it did take us 20 to 25 minutes to start playing the way I want us to play and the way the, way the, the boys want to play um, because I thought they were good after that you know we really started taking control of it and with a couple of good passages good moves you know I think the second and third goals are, are really good as well you know looking forward to watching them back unbelievable and really good movement you know <laughs> listen Kev. We, we know what Kev Collie can bring, and, and that I thought his performance today, not just the goal, take the goal out of it. I thought, I thought he, was, he was very good, but to a man, you know, I, I don't like singling people, you know that. You know, I think that there was a lot of good performances and a lot of strong performances, and even guys that are coming off the bench to make an impact, all that, to get on the pitch, which is great. Um, so, no, overall, really pleased. Have you had a look at the scores elsewhere? I think St Johnson held on for the win, I'm not actually 100% sure on that because I didn't check at the end. Re but re regardless, it's like I always say, we, we focused on today and that was exactly what we did. We got the three points, now we're going to Tuesday. We focus on St Johnson and we see what happens there. There's nothing else, you can't start planning based on other results or based on how other perform how, how other teams are doing. It's all about you, it's all about the 11, and, or not even 11, it's all about the, the squad in there and how how they're responding to um, what we're asking them to do and I thought today was, was much much improved on Tuesday night and not just the result, the, the performance as well. Yeah, but you get no time to turn it around either so how's the squad feeling after that game? Not really good and that, listen that's why I want to use the squad because we've got a good bench there and we spoke about that at half time about how it's so important to go out there and, and really continue to work hard because the boys are in, in really good shape in terms of their fitness so it was about making sure we, we went out second half and, and, and worked really, really hard because we've got guys that are ready to come off, off the bench and, and help the, the team that's on there. So that's what it's all about. It's a squad effort and everybody's feeling OK today. Um, so hopefully it'll be a clean bill of health for, for Tuesday, obviously, apart from um, Dave Devine and, and Shea. We'll, we'll still check on Shea from the, the dead leg. But no, we're looking in, in good shape for Tuesday. Thanks very much, Andy.